What you want to do first is to click the Start menu, then head into Settings. Next, go to System, scroll down, and click on Recovery. Now under Recovery Options, you'll see a button that says Reset This PC. Go ahead and click that. All right, so now you'll see two choices. Keep My Files and Remove Everything. Now, after you choose Keep My Files, Windows will ask how you want to reinstall the operating system. You'll see two options, Cloud Download and Local Reinstall. And this part trips people up, so here's what each one means. Cloud Download. This option downloads a fresh, up-to-date version of Windows 11 directly from Microsoft's servers. It's a bigger download, usually around 4 to 5 gigabytes, so you'll need a stable internet connection. But the upside? You get the cleanest install possible with the latest features and fewer chances of bugs. Local Reinstall. This one uses the existing system files already on your computer. It's faster since nothing has to be downloaded, and it's great if your internet is slow or unreliable. But if your current system is buggy or corrupted, this reinstall might carry those issues over or miss new updates. So which should you pick? If you've got good Wi-Fi and some time to spare, go with Cloud Download. It's the cleaner, safer option. If you're in a hurry or have no internet access, local reinstall will still work just fine but it may not fix everything if there were deeper problems. Depending on what you chose between keeping your files or removing everything, you'll get a summary of what will happen. Review it carefully. For us, since we chose to keep the files, apps and settings will be removed, but our files stay untouched. When you're ready, hit reset. Your PC will restart and begin the process. And that's it. A clean reset without losing your stuff. If this helped you out, be sure to like the video and subscribe.